Enchanted by her, I forgot to come in myself. Oh my gosh. Like, oh yeah, I'm supposed to sing too. Gosh. Okay. So this next song is um, one that I released not too long ago. It was my last single that I released. And I, well, I'll be releasing an, another one soon. But, um, <laughs> inspired by something my mom told me. So I, I mentioned I came out a few years ago and before I announced it to everybody on my socials, I decided to call my mom first and tell her. And I said, hey mom, just so you know, I'm gonna start dating guys. And uh, she said, honey, I love you, but I love God more and I can't accept this about you. And she said, I testify that God's plan for you is for you to marry a woman and have lots of kids. And I was like, mom, believe me, like, I, and I appreciate where she was coming from because I said, Mom, up until like a week ago, I believed the exact same thing. I get it. But um, I don't need you to accept what I'm doing. I just need you to respect that I'm doing the best thing for me right now. And she said, okay, like I can do that. And then I tried to do both things, but it was just too much to do, to try and stay my religion. I grew up Mormon, a Latter-day Saint, and well, I have a lot of beautiful memories with it. It was just too much to try and do both, it was very controversial. <laughs> and um, so I stepped away from my church, and when it got announced, I didn't hear from my mom for a few days. I was like, oh no, I pissed my mom off. And then um, after a couple days, she texted me and she said, I decided to step away from the church as well. And uh, I was like, mom, because I know how much a mentor, I'm like, mom, you don't have to do that. I know this is something, she said, you know what, I don't want to be somewhere where my children don't feel loved and welcomed. And um, she said, if you're going to hell, then we're all going to hell with you. <laughs> so, I was like, oh my gosh. And I was really touched by my mom saying that. And I know it wasn't an easy thing for her. Um, so I was like, I'm going to write a song about that. And so I did. And it's called Hell Together. So, uh,